Hello everyone. Welcome to our Research Circle YouTube channel. Our today's topic is Scopus Discontinued Journal List, October 2020. Before going ahead, I request everyone to please subscribe to our Research Circle YouTube channel. You can also download our Research Circle application which is available on Android Play Store and Apple. So as the topic has been mentioned here, we are going to discuss about the discontinued journal list. This year, Scopus is uh, doing some shocking things and giving us shocks like every three months. Uh, from this year, what they have done, they have released four discontinued journal lists. This is the fourth list which is released in October 2020. Earlier, it was released every three months like the first list of this year was released in March 2020. The next list was released in June 2020. Third list released in September 2020. And this is the fourth list which released in October 2020. So considering these list releasing days and months, what we observed is that after every three months, earlier they were releasing the list. Like March 2020, then June 2020, then September 2020. But shockingly, this list had changed our all dimensions. Suddenly, within like one month, they have released one more list. So, I believe that the uh, Scopus is like removing the journals as soon as they get the details that they are doing the papers publication in a bulk, which is considered as a concept in Scopus as a radar. Uh, we also going to discuss about the radar word in further slides. So this is the uh, list of discontinued journals. These are eight journals which are discontinued in October 2020. Almost like 600 plus journals has been discontinued throughout the year. But these eight journals are like new journals which came into this October 2020 new list. You can also search on Scopus uh, website or on Google the Scopus discontinued journal list 2020 October and you will get the excel sheet uh, to download. I have uh, altogether has made this PPT in order to understand the new journals which are like released uh, and discontinued. So uh, you must be aware with uh, some journal names as I was aware with the name uh, this humanities and social science reviews. This HSR journal belongs to the India. It's an Indian publisher journal. It's a Q1 journal and it has been discontinued just because of the publication concern. Now, very shockingly, earlier what the Scopus was doing is that uh, if the journal is Q1, they were degrading the quartile first and then they were discontinuing the journal. So, for example, as the Humanities and Social Sciences Reviews, it was a Q1 journal. So, it shall get degraded and shall become the Q2 journal. But rather than doing this, they have directly discontinued that journal and just because of publication concern and uh, giving about the information about the statistics almost like 1000 plus articles were published in 2020 and 2019 altogether of this journal so yes the publication concern was there i am also aware with these two journals which belongs to the public uh, publisher world academy of research in science and engineering world academy of research in science and engineering uh, the short form is varse uh, this Varsi also belongs to the Indian publisher and these two journals were engineering journals. It was a Q4 journal. It was a paid journal. The article processing charges which were available on their website was $200 and they were publishing the articles. But yes, because of the publication concern, these two journals also got discontinued. Next journal is International Journal of Supply Chain Management. Now the publisher is excellent uh, take publisher. Well, this journal was very popular in uh, world market of this publication and uh, supply chain management was a Q3 journal and like it got discontinued because of the publication concern. I believe that they were publishing the articles very promptly and with the review process. But yes, it uh, the journal got very much popularity and uh, they have also published the articles in a quantity as well so they got discontinued 
next journal is journal of environment treatment technique well this journal is not indian journal it's a iran based journal iran based journal and uh, the publisher is dorma journals uh, they were publishing the articles related to the environment however only like 180 articles somewhere now were published in 2020 but still it got discontinued because of the publication concern then the large journal is planned archive it is also belonging to the india uh, the publisher is dr rs adab and yes it is also got discontinued because of the publication concern uh, the reason is they have published so many special issues with n number of articles the first journal is abp review it's not a online journal it's a print journal i'm not so aware with that journal but it's a print journal belonging to the abp corporate management services ag and the reason for discontinuation is radar so i'm going to tell you about the radar uh, i'm also planning to make one more video on radar because radar is pretty much important these days the radar is a software tool which has been generated by Scopus to identify the mass publication that has been happening in the Scopus index journal. So for example, if any journal would be publishing the articles probably more than 100 in a year, it will be uh, considered under the radar software tool, it will be identified and then it will go under investigation, then further verification would be done. and if the publication concerns are there it will be directly removed from scopus list then uh, second is annals day documentation it belongs to the university of Mercia. it was not meeting scopus criteria actually the scopus has given some criteria that the publisher name shall be represented on the website the editor in chief name shall be there editorial board through shall be throughout the world it should not be belonging to the one e country so these are some uh, rules which we need to follow uh, and the, it was not meeting the Scopus criteria so that's why it got discontinued. So these are the eight journals which got discontinued in the October 2020. The next slide is actually belonging to the final coverage, the last process uh, in a Scopus. I mean if you have published your articles uh, till what volume, what issue and what page it is going to be indexed. If your article is ahead of these page ranges it is not going to index now just for your information uh, you must be aware with the journal name test engineering and management they have published almost more than 5000 plus articles in a year and uh, earlier the index articles which were showing on the scopus.com was like uh, 2000 plus articles and suddenly when the journal got discontinued the Scopus removed all the index articles and if you'll see the test engineering and management Scopus index uh, journal uh, web, uh, uh, putting ISSN on scopus.com and will check the index articles in 2020 it is showing only one article. So yeah the Scopus has also changed this policy that they have the authority to an index the article which are already indexed if they feel that the journal is doing the mass publication. So I got the details from this Excel sheet. However, some details were missing in that Excel sheet. So I failed to mention over here. But yeah, the details were available of analysis documentation, International Journal of Supply Chain Management and Plan Archives. The issues are also mentioned there. Analysis documentation issue one, page range the first uh, May. Uh, 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 sorry, the page number is, it has been represented as May, but it is 0, 01 to 0, 05. The page range is 0, 01 to 0, 05. Then International Journal of Supply Chain Management, the page range is 1269, 1275. So for example, if your article is way uh, behind this 1276 page number, then your article is not going to index at all. The planned archive, the issue is supplement 2. It's a special issue. They have released page supplement 1, supplement 2, supplement 3, like these issues and published the mass uh, article. So uh, the articles which are going to index in the uh, Scopus directory is only limited till supplement 2. The further articles will not be get indexed. So this is about all those uh, October lists. I will be coming with a few more videos which will definitely help you. Um, just wanted to thanks to all the people who have downloaded this research circle app. We are trying hard to uh, get more work workshops, webinars, uh, FDP conferences for you at a minimal price or probably the free of cost 
we are also giving the daily alerts related to the research or publication now we have released the connect section for all researchers where you can connect with the people who are uh, very good academicians having good citations and you can connect with them and also we uh, also discuss about the yes journals as we discussed right now so i thanks and congratulate to everyone who has downloaded our research circle app we have crossed 5000 plus downloads and those who haven't downloaded right now i request everyone to please download our research circle app please subscribe to our research circle youtube channel for further updates thank you so much that's it from my side for today bye bye